Quite strange and almost entirely composed of neutrons with incredible density. Neutron stars. By watching this video to the end, you will learn what neutron stars are, where they come from, see what secrets these stars hide and the new discovery of scientists over a giant, massive star. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, do it right now. Join the space community, stock up on delicious cookies. 3, 2, 1, let's fly! What are neutron stars? These mysterious cosmic bodies are one of the possible results of the evolution of stars, which consists of a neutron core covered with a crust of matter in the form of atomic nuclei and electrons. Basically, their development is influenced by the speed of rotation around its axis and the magnetic field. Since its own rotation slows down over time and the magnetic field weakens, other properties and processes also change. Have you heard of radio pulsars? This type of neutron star has a high rotational speed and strong magnetic fields. They push out charged relativistic particles emitted in the radio range. A striking example that was discovered first in the radio pulsar PSR B1919-21. Propeller stars, on the other hand, do not emit charged particles, but due to the high speed of rotation and the strength of the magnetic field, the substance is supported above the surface. There is also an X-ray pulsar or accretor, which differs in that in it the matter enters the surface. Due to the low rate of revolutions, the substance descends in the state of plasma. It heats up and as a result begins to glow brightly in the X-ray range. Very beautiful, right? But the pulsation occurs as a result of rotation during which an eclipse of hot matter occurs. For example, the first accretor, Centaurus X3, not only had a pulsation of its brightness, but also constantly changed its oscillation period. And this is a georotator. It has a low rotational speed, which causes an increase in body mass with the help of the gravitational force of gas from the surrounding space. This process, by the way, is called accretion. Recently, with the help of the Green Bank Radio Telescope, scientists have found the most massive neutron star in the history of observations. Each massive neutron star that scientists discover gradually brings specialists closer to determining the very tipping point that keeps the neutron star from collapsing. As the white dwarf passed in front of the neutron star's radio beam, astronomers were able to detect a slight delay in the incoming radio waves. This happened because the white dwarf's gravity warped the space around it causing passing radio waves to travel one touch further than usual. The discovered star J0740 plus 6620 turned out to be a type of pulsar. I think it is worth mentioning one more type, ergo stars. In fact, this is a theoretically possible type. According to scientists, such an object can be formed during the merger or collision of neutron stars. It, in theory, lies somewhere between the event horizon and the limit of static. Simply put, such objects have a place to be. But this is not accurate. For the first time, they were discovered only in 1967. Moreover, it was a radio pulsar from the constellation Volpacula. Now the number of neutron stars found already exceeds 2500. Neutron stars are formed when an ordinary star collapses under its own gravity, becoming a supernova. The resulting neutron star remnant is much smaller and denser. Previously, physicists also suggested that when two neutron stars collide, a single object with a mass exceeding the tolman oppenheimer volkov limit will appear and therefore collapses into a black hole. However, this limitation only applies to neutron stars that stop spinning due to a collision. Now scientists have been shocked when they have suggested that a star that does not rotate can still exist for a certain period of time under certain circumstances. If such a neutron star were to emerge, it would have a unique signature consisting of rapid bursts of gamma rays, then X-rays initially, and then rapid bursts of radio waves as its gravitational field weakened. Do you believe in the possibility of its existence? Have you eaten cookies? Thanks for subscribing to my channel and watching this video. Join the community of science and space fans using the links in the description of this video. Hug everyone!